Your anterior teeth from canine to canine are for shearing. What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and I have something from Japan, another box from Japan. This time, it is a shrimp in the snack Dragon Ball wafer. This is the wafer snack Chusenshi, Chuseni. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. They have some really exciting stickers, and the snacks are good as well. These are these are higher quality wafers than the other shrimp in the snacks we did. I don't quite put them on the level of Bikurimen, but they are, I appreciate them very much. So this is our shrimp today. I am excited. There's some really, really hype stickers some beautiful art in these. If this is your guys' first time here and you want to see shrimpums of all sorts of Dragon Ball nature on a weekly basis, especially Dragon Ball Super Card Game, make sure to hit that subscription button. And if you're a returning member of the Joe Crew, this should be an exciting one. If you guys were here for stream, we did a shrimp one of these and it was pretty, pretty fantastic. This is the shrimp on the snack. Here's the art here. It's got Gogeta on it. Uh, there's Broly and Chilai eating some snacks over here. And this kind of explains to you how to open the box and it has this number. Uh, this is some more of the art. I like the, the GT art says Dan Dan on it, which is really exciting. This is not a bootleg. This has the toy animation seal of approval. So you know this is a legitimate product. It does not have the bootlegger's signal on it. Let's get into the sh 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 shrimp em, the snack. All right, let's pop that open. Let me get these snacks out of here. So let's get this snack, be blessed. Oh, snack it, be blessed. Please have it, this shiny Gogeta or Goku. There's lots of different kinds of rarities in this, but this is our blessing to snack here. Let's uh, strip in some of these snacks, huh? All right, so we got this Gogeta art here. This is, I think this is the rarest sticker in the set. That's the Gogeta one. And I'm just kind of pop these open, strip them. And get the sticker out here. This one is, ooh, Raditz. Named after the vegetable that grows in the ground, more commonly called a radish. Goku's brother, looking very fierce, he's got his scouter on and he's ready to step on something, squash someone. Maybe Goku's son, he's got this fierce aura around him. What's really cool about this set is actually all of the stickers have some level of texture on the foiling. It's there, there are a lot, even the commons. Oh, actually this is an SR rarity, I guess. Maybe that's why it's textured. Um, but I felt like a lot of them had some level of texture on them. So that's pretty exciting. Oh, are these chocolate? They're usually vanilla. I'll have to check one out at the end. Ooh, Gohan, very cool. I think this is the AR rarity because it has this text on it here. Yeah, AR, number 18 from the set. His power is 5,000, that is very exciting. Wow, look at the, the, this one has that kind of rainbow diamond foiling on it. Really nice, really excellent to look at, really nice on the eyes. Wow, wow wee, really good stuff, quite excellent. Gohan, taking after Piccolo, he's got Piccolo's cape on, he's got Piccolo's threads. I like this Gohan a lot, I like when he had this haircut, he just, he had so much potential. And of course, we all know what happened with that. You know, I think I'm just gonna slice him the snacks. That might be a little easier. I'm continuously trying to strip them with difficulty. And the next one is, ooh, Goten. Goten from GT. And it has the little dun dun, yeah, da, 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 da. I don't know what that song means, but this is a snack. And he's got a pretty cool car there as well. I really, I wasn't as much of a fan of Goten and GT, I think. I like Goten when he's a kid. And, uh, you know, I think he has a lot of potential in whatever comes next in Dragon Ball Super. I think he and Trunks are going to play a bigger part than they did in... Oh, -ho! Yosha! Yo! This is sick! This is the GGR rarity, the good game rarity here. Wow, this is really nice. I'm going to have to get a closer look at this one. Wow, the GG rarity. Oh man. Ooh, oh, that is good looking. Wow, that the foiling is really, really cool. It's got this rainbow foiling on it, and it also has a gold stamp on top of that. It's very, very excellent looking, beautiful art. I love this moment. I believe this is on Namek when Goku is kind of charging to fight Frieza. He's got the blood on his face. Krillin just died, and he's avenging his friend and getting Frieza out of the way. The one thing about these is that you always kind of get these crumbs because they 
come inside of a snack pack. I wonder if PSA or BGS would ever grade these. That would be that would be pretty wild. Um, but God, I love these shrimp in the snacks. This art is just so good looking. It's so nice. They're so cute. They're so cute and strong with the big heads. It's very cool. GG rare. Let's shrimp them. Oh, they're slicing the snack. Haven't seen Gogeta at all. Would be cool to get a Gogeta sticker here. Another dun dun yeah dun 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 pan. I don't really remember this part. I watched GT once. I didn't really pay all that much attention. The story didn't really get me there. The character design is awesome. I love the character design. And I like what they do in Heroes, how they kind of bring it all back together. Kind of connect the different storylines and timelines and make it all kind of legitimate stories but you know z is definitely better yeah see this one okay so we have this one this one this one does have some texturing on it also and this is a rare and this is a um this is n so normal or something but this also has some texture on the foiling you guys can see there's like this embossed printing there so these are all I, they, they put a lot of energy into these stickers stickers have really advanced uh printing methods that are used to make them and they're really the art is just really great i love these strip on the snacks they they don't come out all that frequently i think maybe three or four times a year they usually have a new set or something like that Oh, Piccolo, Piccolo Daimo, Masenko Sampo. This is cool. This one has a cool, it's almost like a fingerprint. So like you really can't, I don't think people are ever going to bootleg these. I don't know how they would be bootlegging these snacks that well. Such good art. So amazing. God, I love it so much. What a treat. What a treat for the eyeballs. Really, really good looking stuff. Piccolo's got a lot of thought going on in that head there. He's a vein. There's all this blood going to his brain to have to make the right decisions of how to unleash his ultimate attack he has a goku new attack hey goku have you been practicing any new attacks or have you just been having a kid great we have this bad guy here that we have to defeat and you're busy having a child while i was mastering this new attack but here's chilai chilai offering a snack it looks like because here broly try this snack we're on this spaceship maybe this is how we can become friends why don't you try this out? It's a really good snack. You'll like it. Saw you roll up and kick that bug in the head. It was really cool. I think uh, I think that was a really cool move when you saved our life by kicking that bug in the head. Maybe maybe I'll take this opportunity to give you this snack. You'll like it, and maybe you'll like it. That's just a normal. Also, I think, and it's just the foiling. They really they really went the distance with this set. And I think Ami Ami was limiting this. You can only get so many per household. Uh, because they're just oh yeah goku son goku but it looks like sometimes the wafer bits get in the dust like from the snack gets in the inside of this this is a gr so this is a higher level rarity and it, this has some this has some textured foiling down there as well as the rainbow foil it's like a confetti what a party what a party to look at and they even got some of this here with the texture in between really cool good looking stuff sometimes it's nice to just treat your eyes by looking at gorgeous dragon ball art i can tell you that well stripping the snack and Yamcha and Chi Chi. Yamcha and Chi Chi on the dragon. This one's got texture also. I think they all have some texture. That's very, very cool. What a great set. What a fantastic set. I would love to collect all of this set. But I think this set actually is a lot more expensive buying it in post. I saw some boxes listed for just like a much higher price. So I would probably Maybe I'll try and just buy the individual stickers. That might be a more effective way of dun dun yeah. This is trunks and go poo and pan flying into space to go get dragon balls in space. I think they have did the whole dragon balls in space thing a, a little bit better with Dragon Ball Super. Dragon Ball Super. Tor Toriyama did write this did write super or was involved with the writing of super, so I think the, the writing of super was superior. Superior. Ooh, UI Goku, very rad. Whoa, cool. And there's texture inside the silver foil on that confetti rainbow. Wow, look at that fierce punch. You do not want to get hit with that fist. That's going to knock you out of the park. Let's get these guys out of the park. That must be a GR. Yeah, it's a GR rarity right there. Good rare. I don't know what that stands for. He's got, yeah, he's got 9,500 power. That's uh, 
it's pretty powerful. It's over 9,000. So I think that qualifies as, man, this is gorgeous. I'm definitely going to need to photograph this and wear it around. Next, strip them. What a fire strip them that was. This is in a pretty great box. There's some really nice pulls in here. We'll have to try one of these snacks also. Oh, Piroff, the Piroff machine. All three, the three, assemble. Texture there as well. Absolutely great looking. We got all this snack dust here. Slice them to snack for the shrimp em ease. The ease of shrimp em. Ooh, dun dun, yeah, da 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 da. Goku on the. I don't even remember this part. I feel like this is on the end. He like rides away on, on a Shenron somewhere. Track one out of four. Oh, these must be the songs. They must have the different songs. Yeah, look, this says track two out of four. <laughs> these must be the, the maybe the parts of the song or names. I don't know, but it looks like it's a disc of some sort down there. Goku is looking like he's having a good time listening to a lit track with Shenron, red Shenron around him. I don't really remember what the deal was with that red Shenron. Slice them. Yeah, I'm definitely not, definitely not, I'm definitely not one to ask questions about uh, Dragon Ball GT. Ooh, yo, Vegeta. This is the AR rarity, I think. He's got 4,400 power. Not quite as powerful as the UI. I don't know if there's any sort of game you can play with. I have no idea what these words say. I would Google translate them, but I don't think that would actually explain all that much. These just look great. They're so fun to look at. They even have the, te they have some sort of texture on the characters as well in the, in the kanji. I think that's kanji. Very rad. What a treat. I wonder if we're going to get any, I, I don't know what the rarity distribution is in here. I know we got that one that was like the gold. The gold one, the GGR rarity, I think it was. But here's another another Gohan. Lil Gohi blasting out of the spaceship. He heard his he heard Peepa was hurt and his uncle was hurting him. So he got very mad and he blasted out of his spaceship. And uh his power hit 2000, which at the time was pretty dang impressive, I gotta tell you. You know, it's no UI level. And Goku pro Gohan probably could have gone further beyond had he pursued his training. But here we go. Oh, Gogeta! I haven't seen this one. This is an SR. Nice. It's pretty cool looking. I like that finger pose, like they're going to tap on somebody's shoulder. Excuse me. Guess what? I'm here to grab you with my other three fingers and poke you in the eyes or something like that. Really good looking. As we sli I think some more slice and slice and crack them, whatever you want to call it, get in here. Pull out the wafer sticker. Broly! Snacking Broly. Yeah, look at that. He was on the spaceship. Chi Lai just handed him the snack. He said, Oh, thank you. You know, I've actually only eaten the inside of bug legs for the entirety of my life. There's this green slime that comes out of it, and uh, it's pretty nutritious. You can tell by the level of my fitness uh, how I'm in de pretty decent shape, but I've just been eating bugs my whole life. I've never drank any water. Wow, Chi Lai, thank you for this extremely tasty snack. I greatly appreciate the gesture. No, uh, Broly is not that good with words yet. He hasn't really spoken to anyone ever <laughs> other than his dad and and Ba, his best friend. I don't know how much speaking was going on there. Ooh, Tian Shinhan, the AR, Tian. Very cool. Kiko Ho! Kiko Ho! I think is that move. And yeah, the texture, the texture there on the X. AR rarity. And of course, our blessing the snack. What a fun trip and ride this has been. We've had so many gorgeous uh, stickers inside these little wafer snacks. And the wafers are delightful as well. And in our last bless him, oh bless him be true, our shrimp him comes out unto you. It is the front of the dragon. I have not gotten the front of this Shenron, so I think we have the whole parts of Shenron. Very cool. Very, very gorgeous. What a fun snack. We gotta try one of these things out. I don't know. I, just, I think this is the first time they've been chocolate wafers. I want to say thank you guys for coming by to shrimp them the snack. I hope you enjoyed seeing some of these beautiful snack shrimp them. But guys, I am a dentist and I can't end the episode without doing a dental tooth tip. This is a snack. People eat snacks with their front teeth and their back. Your front teeth are for incising or shearing. Your back teeth are molars. Wow, these snacks are good. I think I prefer the chocolate. I'm used to the vanilla, but these are chocolate wafers. So your your anterior teeth from canine to canine are for shearing. 
Your posterior teeth behind your canine to your last molar are for chewing to create a bolus, which is what you have in your mouth before you swallow it. It's important to chew your food effectively so that you can digest it easily. But I would definitely recommend these snacks. They are um, premier quality. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoy this shrimp. If this is your guys' first time here and you enjoy seeing this shrimp and these snacks, please take the time to smush that subscription button if you're a returning member of the Joe Crew. Thank you for checking it out. I've had a great time. And anyway, we hop on the Holy Hexagon. We shrimp them every week. It's fantastic. Get to look at these things up close and personal. I hope you guys enjoy seeing the high resolution image. Hopefully, next week or the week after, we'll have some set 13 to shrimp them. I'm so excited. The set looks so good and it's not nearly as messy to open up and leave as much snack dust around. But I am Joku DMD. This has been the shrimp from the snack and I will see you guys next time.